Andrew, what were your first thoughts of the Hawk? I was, oh, I was lucky enough to fly the Hawk on uh, Hull Davis, so waiting for the rest of my flying train to start. And um, well, actually, <laughs> weirdly, if you guess, initially I was a bit disappointed because I expected the first time I flew in a fast jet, I was going to have a real kick in the back Top Gun style, mm -hmm. you know, be propelled off the runway. But of course, the Hawk's not got a massive engine and it's not got reheat, mm -hmm. so that didn't happen. But once we were airborne, I um, absolutely loved it, Mike. It's just, uh, I mean, I wasn't handling it at that time. It was an instructor of mine, um, Jack London from the Royal Navy, and we were flying in formation with a, a guy that was converting from being helicopters to fast jet. And I just remember flying formation and at that stage then it sort of kicks you like I'm in a fast jet. This aircraft feels amazing so yeah um, great. Uh, for, so currently for the Royal Navy is uh, in, in support essentially of uh, uh, the Royal Navy doing things like ship attack so acting as if they're sort of either aircraft or simulated missiles and I know they do some work as well on exercise in, in conjunction with the Royal Air Force so they essentially act in support to play a role simulate a sort of role of either an aircraft or a missile in flight to attack other aircraft or ships. So can you talk us through some of your ground training? Yeah, the ground training, no pilot likes <laughs> ground training, Mike. So uh, from my perspective, I've sort of erased most of those ground training memories from my mind. Uh, I do have vague recollections of ground training, but it's, it's, it's sort of evaporated, <laughs> if I'm honest with you. Can you remember your first flight in the Hawk? Um, I can. My, my first sort of seat in, a, in a front of a, of a Hawk was at RAF Valley, going through advanced uh, flying training after leaving Linton on Ouse. And I just remember being sat there and it looked completely different in the front to being sat in the back. Um, it almost felt like you, you weren't sat in something, you were sort of out there in, in open space flying around. Really, really amazing feeling. And, uh, and the instructor I was with, a guy called Jamie Harms, uh, another Navy instructor, and he just, he just really sort of enthused me into flying this jet and we had a great time. I just loved that first flight.